What's going on guys? Welcome to my $1,000 Revzilla gear haul video. So guys, I am extremely excited to bring you guys a video that I've been working on with Revzilla. Revzilla is a online motorcycle gear dealership. You can get any type of gear you need from those guys online. They're fantastic. I love working with them. They challenged me. They said, Chase, we'll give you $1,000. Use our gear guide on our website and pick out an entire set of gear, helmet to boots, and see what you can come up with. So I did. Also, make sure to stay to the end of this video because everything I'm talking about is getting given away. Happy Christmas. So guys, let's we'll start off with the helmet that I chose. The one I got is the Shark Raw Helmet. Now, online, I saw this thing and I was like, oh my God, that's awesome. Then I saw the price tag, $289. And I'm like, woo, that's going to be like a third of my budget. Okay, cool. Whatever. I don't have a helmet like this. I'm buying gear for me. So if I was given that challenge, that was what I was going to get. I thought it was pretty cool. I've had it and I found out that it's a three quarter helmet. Like you could bend this up, which makes it even cooler because I have definitely nothing like that. Um, I thought it was pretty neat and helmet wise, I am okay with spending some money on because that is what's going to keep me alive at the end of the day. So. Um, I'm not going to buy some cheap helmet just to save my budget. So yeah, I sunk 289 into the helmet. I think it looks awesome though. There you go. Moving on. So next up, let's talk jackets. I was looking on there. I checked out their gear guide and this thing comes highly recommended. This is the Revit GTR Air textile jacket Christmas. That is a long name. So one of the things I liked about this jacket, one, I like the look of it with the helmet. I've got this blacked out helmet. I've got this white with black accented jacket, super light, super premium feel with like the rubber on the neck and everything. Um, and this just feels like a premium textile jacket. Now textile jackets, you're not going to get the kind of wear and tear you get out of something like leather. I personally have a lot of leather jackets. I don't really have a lot of textile jackets. I currently live in Atlanta. Now it's cold right now, but it gets super hot. So having a white textile jacket for those really hot days is going to be fantastic. And it's going to be a really good combo, I think, with the, uh, with the Shark Raw helmet. All right, moving onward. So next up, we're moving to gloves. Now, if you guys haven't been able to tell with the gear I've already showed, I'm kind of building this kind of light gear that's good for urban riding in the hot weather. It's cold right now in Georgia, but come summertime, it is gonna be blistering hot. So I'm kind of building a summer vibe as far as what gear I'm picking out. And for the gloves, I've got the Icon Wireform gloves. So I picked these things up because they're 50 bucks. I love my Icon gear. You guys can see the rack. I got tons of it. So I love the brand and it's only 50 bucks. And I mean, I trust Icon's gear. I've wrecked in Icon gear before and I've always been okay. So for 50 bucks, I'm like, okay, cool. These things don't have a lot of armor, but the armor they do have is on the uh, knuckles and it's like their D3O, like super safe stuff. And uh, they just seem like a really good grab for 50 bucks. So I was like, yes, please. Circling back real quick about the jacket, I totally realized I'm talking about a $1,000 gear guide video and I didn't talk about the price of the jacket. So the helmet I dropped about $239, the gloves I grabbed for $50. This guy's going to come in about $219, I got, I got it for $219. Revzel always has discounts and stuff going on so you guys are going to have a little fluctuating of the price. But $219 for that jacket and as premium as it feels, that was a steal. I'm trying to make up for the dang $230 on the helmet. Next up, we're talking pants. All right guys, so as far as pants go, I went with the Scorpion Covert Pro jeans. Now these guys come in at about $125, but they look just like jeans. This material is called like Cordera or something like that. It's supposed to be like very good for like abrasion and stuff like that. So I can look like I'm wearing blue jeans, but I will actually be safe riding. They've got Kevlar on the inside on like the hips and stuff like that. So if you do go on and get it in a wreck or something like that, you should be solid. And you get that like low profile look. I mean, they're called Covert Pro, like Covert. Like they look like jeans, but they save you like riding pants. You gotta have riding pants. Too many guys ride around in jeans. 
I want you guys to research what happens when you have a low side when you're wearing jeans, like regular like jeans. They shred. Invest the money, 120 bucks, get you a pair of riding jeans and just ride in the jeans. That way you get the look you want and they, they're comfortable, like these feel like jeans. Please, I see too many people riding around in just regular jeans, it's terrifying. All right, my final thing, the thing I was most excited for, the shoes. All right guys, the name on these is a little rough. Ready? These are the TCX X Street waterproof shoes. I love the shit out of these shoes. These things are actually on closeout right now. When uh, when I did my video, I got them for 149. They're actually on closeout for $99. I don't know why. So, the whole point of this whole gear setup is to get something that I can ride around in, be super comfortable. You know, we're talking about like ride around town. I'm not talking about go to the mountains. I'm talking about downtown, slow speeds, stuck in traffic, making stops, going in and out. These are safe as riding boots, not safe as riding boots, but these are much safer than regular tennis shoes. They give the look of regular tennis shoes and they are also waterproof. The second I got these, I have done nothing but wear them when I ride and I absolutely love having a pair of what is essentially tennis shoes that I can just throw on and go ride. I don't gotta put boots on and like strap up and all this kind of crap because at the end of the day, if something is cumbersome and you don't wanna ride in it, you're gonna ride in it less, which means all the money you spend on buying it is gonna be pointless. But $100 for these and you've got riding shoes that you're safe to ride in, dude, it is a no-brainer. So guys, with $1,000, this is the motorcycle kit that I decided to make. I used RevZilla's gear guide. They have like a gear guide where they tell you the best of stuff to help me determine what I want. And a lot of this stuff was their top performing gear of 2016. So make sure to check that thing out if you're looking for gear and you don't know about good reviews and you can't find any good reviews online. They actually do a fantastic job. So big shout out to RevZilla for helping out with this video and uh, just working with me in general to make this happen. Now, I know you guys are curious, how can you get some free stuff as well? Well, in the next five days, I'm gonna be doing one review per day of each of the items I just talked about. In the comments of those videos, RevZilla is going to be looking for comments and choosing one person per video, and they're gonna be giving away the item that I talked about in the video. Each video is gonna be a review of the helmet, a review of the gloves, a review of the pants, so on and so forth. Five videos, five days, five items getting given away to you guys. Make sure you're subscribed and hit that little bell notification so you are alerted when that video goes live so you can be the first guy to comment and get the first option at getting one of these things. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to hit that like button and big shout out to RevZilla for actually working with a YouTuber because I don't think that's happened before. So shout out to those guys. Make sure to check out RevZilla if you need any type of motorcycle gear. Those guys are fantastic. I'll leave links in the description to all the objects you see behind me. But guys, I'm Chase on Two Wheels. You guys have some happy holidays and ride safe. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Later.